everyone. Welcome to the Fashion Experiment. It's Dr. Bridget. I'm back uh, with a video on key items in the denim category for winter 23. My last video, I shared insight on the denim category in general. So you want to check that out just so you understand where we're coming from this season with denim and just the idea of not just focusing on jeans, but giving consumers a, a whole wardrobe of denim pieces. So focusing on tops, jeans, skirts, jackets, and variety, lots and lots and lots of variety, which is exciting. If you're a denim lover like me, I'm excited to be able to purchase um, a variety of different denim tops that have not typically been available, you know, seasonally. So that's exciting. So let's look at some key items this season. Um, and it's menswear and women's wear. So remember, um, this fall winter, we're reconnecting. Consumers are reconnecting and you're being dressed for different purposes and different perspectives. All right. So the whole um, educated, academic, preppy look um, is trending. A workwear look for menswear is trending. A work leisure look is trending for men and women. It's lots of different looks. And I really, as I'm saying that, need to do some videos on the different looks. I'm definitely going to do a work leisure video, but that's an idea I need to write down. All right. So as we move through, you're really going to see that each of the garment styles speak to a look and that's what I'm going to connect to it and also the classic a, a that capsule classic closet is also present all right so the hickory stripe shirt I talked about in my first denim video the different textures and the focus on prints and patterns for denim and this is what this speaks to it speaks to workwear a workwear look, um, like like a uniform shirt look, okay, with style, okay, and the print. So this is a striped denim shirt, but you're going to find printed denim shirts and menswear, lots of variety. But this is the standout one. All right, all right. Next is the statement print jean. This season printed denim is king and queen like you're, you're going to find so many varieties of printed denim all right so and i i spoke about this in a previous video that you want to get a, a a printed denim jean like to be on trend and i'm just excited about it, like i said because i love denim um and the fact that there's going to be variety you know it's not just a couple options it's going to be multiple looks and styles and options in the denim category. So look for the statement printed denim and floral and animal print, different stripes, geometric shapes is also one. They'll be out there. All right, and then of course, the fuller denim jean in menswear and women's wear, the boot cut, the wide leg, um, yeah. I mean, it's not much to say about it. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I'm not going to like oversell it. And the same with the cargo paint. These are key denim items that I'm speaking of. So I've said it multiple times, like cargo paint is going to be everywhere. <sighs> everywhere, cargo paint. It's a key item in denim. It's a key item in women's wear. It's a key item in men's wear, you know, in different fabrications, not just denim, but cargo pants. And then this is the, the female interpretation of the cargo pant. All right. And then you just see, um, as I've shared before, you, you're going to see it in every type of fabric you can think of, every interpretation you can think of. Okay. Denim sweatpants, uh, dress pants, khaki pants, any type of pant that exists, there will be a cargo pant interpretation for it. Joggers, you know, everywhere. 
And then the wide leg, denim pant, and menswear, and women's wear. And there'll be different variations of it, you know, a super flare, super wide, and then just your traditional flare or traditional wide leg. And I mean, flare and wide are not the same. I'm just sharing that it's going to be different um, interpretations of a wide leg paint. Okay. All right. This is cool. They're calling it the 90s barn coat, but just notice that it's printed. So just think a printed denim jacket, okay, is what it is. And that's basically what they call it, a barn coat. It's a printed denim jacket. So excited. I'm so excited. I love denim. Can't wait to get some printed denim. <laughs> All right. And I shared before in, the pre in my previous denim video that typically we see denim done in jeans and, you know, are given multiple varieties of jeans in denim. This season, we're going to see other garments, and that is skirts, dresses, blouses, different tops other than a button-up denim shirt. So that's what this speaks to. A sp spaghetti strap dress is a key item, a denim spaghetti strap dress. And there will be um, other dresses. Again, this is the key item. And also think about it as a jumper. Okay. So you could layer it as you see it being layered in the um, images here, like spaghetti, spaghetti strap dress. I think of, I mean, it's just the dress, but if you think of layering it, you know, it just gives you more options and you could, you know, be more creative in how you style it. Next is the hooded trucker jacket. This just speaks to the fuller silhouette that we're moving into. Um, I like this interpretation too because they've added a hood to the jean jacket. And again, it gives us variety and opportunity to style it different and wear it different. So I like the hood that's added to the jean jacket and the fullness of it. But I'm holding out for the printed denim jean jacket. My list. All right. Classic vintage jean. Um, this to me is like the transitional jean uh, fit. So maybe you're like, I love my skinny. I love my fitted silhouette. I'm really not ready for a wide leg, you know, like as my everyday jean. Yeah, I'll add it to my closet, but I need something in the middle. And that's what this speaks to. It's basically a straight leg jean. Um, so slightly full, but not full on wide leg. And it's um, worn. It's, it's giving you that worn look, which I also talked about in the previous video. This season in the denim category, everything is about texture, is about visually stimulating your eyes with the look, the feel, just I just need more than a simple, plain blue jean. And that's what you're going to get this season. Everything is going to have some type of design detail, some type of embellishment, some type of finish, something. Okay, so the classic vintage jean speaks to that. It's a straight leg jean with some type of design detail. All right, so that's wonderful. I love that. Here we are, wide sleeve trucker. Okay. So again, it's like nothing is simple blue jean. Nothing is a simple button up jean shirt. Like we've seen that, we've done that, we have that already. Everything that you're going to get is going to have some type of different oomph to it. All right. So wide leg sleeve for the jean jacket. That's nice. And then statement print trucker. So ah, I got my printed barn coat option. Now you're going to get a statement print trucker. And on the image here, um, the song for the mute brand, he has fringe on his. So it's like, how visually stimulating is that? It's just like, just lots of variety, which I love. And it's going to be exciting to see how it's styled 
and how different, you know, people in the public eye, entertainers wear it and are styled in this because it's different. Like we we've we have not seen printed denim like this at this level with this so many variety of product offerings in a very long time. So it's gonna be exciting to see how it's styled and worn. The classic chore coat. This speaks to the workwear theme, okay, that um, cropped up in menswear. And I talked about that in the menswear um, 2023 trends video. There is a subset theme because it, it doesn't fall into the three major themes that I talked about. So I'm calling it a subset that focused on workwear, the uniform look. So in, again, in the image here, you see Carhartt. Carhartt is a major uh, brand that supplies work uniforms, you know, to many industries, okay? And at one point in history, back in the 90s, like Carhartt, Dickies, another brand, work uniform brand, was super popular. Like, it was, it, everybody was wearing it. And I mean, back in the day, I remember people used to get like a Dick, Dickies outfit, the pants and a jacket, and they would get it airbrushed. And that was just, you know, your fit to wear, wherever you was going, like what? So that's what this speaks to. And it is re-emerging as a, a huge category. Um, yeah, the workwear trend is big. So the chore coat speaks to that. All right. So I was super excited to do this key items video for denim. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you check out more videos on my channel. Like and share and comment. Bye, everybody.